Good evening and welcome back to FTL. We're back with another run here today, guys. And uh, we're going to change it up. We're going to go for the Swallow ship instead of uh, the others. I can't remember what they're actually called. I know one of them is the Red Tail and the Kestrel is the other one, of course. But we're going to go with the Swallow. And because I was saying in the last episode, I was saying in the last run, I was thinking like the layout of the previous ship wasn't really doing it for me. Um, so with the Swallow, um, if the layout B... There we go, no need to rename that again. 1.29. Um two for layout B. So that doesn't actually get as much. Okay, cool. So let's rename you to Fire, Banks, and Elizabeth. Okay, awesome. So yeah, we're gonna go with the swallow. 1.29. Here we go, our 29th run. Let's give it a good go. We see first jump. Let's go down. And hopefully we get a little bit of a better run than we did last time. Um, because we got absolutely kind of... I don't know. We just got kind of messed up last time. We got the Iron Stunner here today. Which should be good if it does hit. It'll stop there. Oh, look at that. It did stun Raffin. But above that, it also means that hitting the shields is going to be way, way better. It's going to continue us. going to keep the shields kind of undone. The first thing we're going to do, as we tend to do, is we're going to upgrade our shields. Um, Valyria. Yeah. And then they still hit us, losers. Valyria, what are your skills? Any skill? skills? Okay, you'll go and work the shields. I think. Yeah, I think so. And then we'll save those new positions. And we need 50 first upgrade. And that way, go that way, connect up, or go through multiple beacons. What I think we want to do this time, when we're planning how we're going to run through sectors. Yeah, we can do that. Um, We're going to kind of have a little bit more of a plan ahead of time when it comes to how we're going to go about things on the sectors. I don't want to, uh, well, I don't want to be fighting the, the rebels as much as we have been. It's been kind of... Kind of annoying to have to fight our way out of things. Okay, that was a good hit, but the dual laser actually missed. It does shoot twice, which is useful. There we go, that one hit, and the shields are going to be down for a bit. Our cameras are actually down and on fire. Isn't great, so let's go put that out. Fact, I guess you both can just go put those fires out because they're gonna they're gonna uh, they're gonna respawn like the, we've already got a clone bay that comes with this ship so burn out the fires get the repairs going and then just back to positions and then they gain health back every time we jump so that's pretty useful okay let's make that jump oh to a store not yet In fact, I'm actually going to go back on that and go and say I am going to go straight to the store and got a small bomb. I don't want it to target my own ship. I don't really want to use that. So let's hire, let's hire Graffin or Scott. Let's hire Graffin. Fix up the hull. And buy some fuel. Graffin, you can work the doors and then kind of stay in this middle section where fighting is most likely to happen. Let's jump away. Uh, turn and fight. Yes, absolutely. Oh, look at that. The Oh, that's not good. The meteors are going to knock the shield. Sorry, the asteroids are going to knock the shields down periodically. And do damage such as that so they've lost their O2 and they're on fire not ideal for them we're just consistently knocking out their shields they're oh my word they really are on fire and there we go it was an asteroid that finished them off and we'll take all that scrap charge up the FTL um, Maxwell's sorry not Maxwell Banks is in there 
I'm going to gain back HP every time we jump. And it's not been the worst start. It's not been the best. We want to get that shield upgrade going. But we've also hired... Well, we've, we've gained two crew members. don't really want to go the nebula, but I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to go through the nebula. Which I don't want to. But we're going to have to. Okay. And stunner weapons. Actually, no. Let's just hit both on the weapons. That makes way more sense. Ah, freaking missiles. Already early doors on the missiles. Okay. One more hit with the dual lasers will do it. Please. It paused. And pause it. There we go. Nice. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, keep going. 20, 20 scrap gain from that one. Jump again. Just Yeah, we'll just jump nearby for the minute. Um, fight the pirate. Have a fight. Yeah, you guys want to have a fight? We look like pirates as well, so... Pirates fight pirates, I guess. Stunner does do... Kind of help, because it also stops them repairing for a little section. No, not very long at all. Let them go. Um, yeah, fine. Okay, now the shield upgrade is there, but we need the two power bars, which will cost us 40. So that'll be the next thing we do. We'll go jump, jump, through the nebula, and then towards the exit. Okay, cool. Pretty simple plan. This is early sectors. Hit the civilian ship. Let's go for it. Where are the shields? They're down there. Level 1 shields, early doors. Valeria is getting good skill. Oh, that's on fire. So we'll get that fire out. All the lasers actually did, did the... Oh, wow! The O2 is... Been hurt. Okay, they're on fire on in their, uh, their shield sector. We're still getting hit every time it's on the O2. Okay, back to positions. One more hit on the dual lasers will do it. There we go. Also, before that beam got the shot. Wait, we've got an iron intruder drone. We do need a jump drone system if we're gonna we're gonna use that. Which I don't really use the drone system all that much. Maybe I should. Never surrender. What are you on about? Not a chance. We're surrendering. Nice, nice. We are definitely going to need some more guns, though, because we just don't have the firepower just yet. But we're still Sector 1. Uh, I'm kind of, like, thinking ahead of the time. It just feels like this sector has been a lot slower. Let's let's stun the engines, then, instead. Oh, my word, they lost their... They lost their... They were two crew members. They just lost one of them. Um, yeah, we'll take Sophia. Sophia, um, you can work... I guess the only real one left is to work the doors now. Make a jump. Go into the nebula. As much as I dislike it. Oh, yep, straight to a fight. Okay, hit the engine. No, not the end. Yeah, you the engines, the weapons, it doesn't matter. So our shields are down because we're in the Ion Storm, I think. Plasma Storm, even. So the Nebula does slow down the Rebel Fleet. Okay, that's actually something I probably should have known, but was unaware. That going through the Nebula does slow them down, which means maybe you get more time. I mean, it means you get more time to jump to sectors and kind of build your ship up a little bit more. There's a lot of features to this game that I'm just learning over time. 
Why can't we jump away? Because we don't have go to the exit, or at least towards the exit. Demand the surrender. Trying to escape, not a chance. Yeah, this fight actually is not going so well because we just don't have the shields up. There we go. Shields will be up now. We took so much damage there because we came out of the ion. We came out of the nebula straight into a fight. We need our shields up. Now that they are up, it does look like they are. Yeah, then they don't really have the firepower to get through and actually damage us. We're knocking their weapons out kind of periodically, which is good because it means that they actually now they can't fire back jump imminent but yeah I, I hit the weapons i meant to hit the engine but they left the drone part behind i jump one and then i think we can get to the exit Okay, it's a two on two. We've got repairs going on. Losing hull integrity every time we fight these guys. But we should actually win this fight. Yeah, Bo's gone. Now you're gone as well. Awesome. Okay, jump. And it is outside. Whoa, that's lucky. That's lucky because we've got no hull integrity. Um, Sell five missiles for 15 scrap. No, no need. Jump. Next sector. Civilian sector should be slightly easier because we are on only five hull integrity, which is not great. Um, there's a store there, which is good, but we can't we don't have any money. Go aid the civilian ship, hit the shields, hit the iron stunner on there as well. Our fighter. There we go, that's good. Double stun on there as well. Oh, miss. Two misses there on the lasers, I think. Or maybe the ion and one of the lasers missed. Here we go. Engine just took some damage, but I don't think our hull integrity took damage. Which is interesting. Yeah, it's interesting. It probably, I think those bombs, got like fire bombs, I think they set... I think they set fires, but I'm not really sure if they do hull damage every time. It's interesting. Yeah, because we're still on five hull integrity here, which is kind of odd. There we go. Done. Get some scrap. Contact five hull points. Yeah, lovely. That's awesome. Um, let's go to this one and then maybe jump to the store and then we'll head into the nebula, which now knowing that it slows down... Don't have to scrap for it. That's annoying. Then we can jump back to the store. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Even though we've gained nothing in the last two places. Scrap recovery. Oh, enough. Sell that. That gives us enough. Yes, I want the scrap recovery arm. Because I want more money basically okay let's jump jump any look at that connected to everything jump this way kind of explore all of the out of the nebula first i don't know it's just like you feel like you i get absolutely mullered whenever i go in the nebula okay well that's only a two on two no matter what happens in there med bay is losing clone bay sorry is losing Get out of there. Okay. Going and fighting the O2. Let's send these guys in next. Oh, wow. We don't have clones. Because the... Oh, that's so annoying. We've lost graphing because they knocked the clones out straight away. Oh, that's so frustrating. Okay, get the clones back. Close all the doors. 
Now go and find where they are. In the shields, okay. Oh, that's so annoying. We've lost Graffin. Sort Willow out. Mess him out. See you later. And back to positions. Did we have... Had another... I can't remember. I can't remember who we had, but we definitely had six. So I'm just out here forgetting forgetting crew members jump to the distress signal then all of our power bars will return cool just taking damage helping people but taking damage go down to the store see what's there for us maybe we can hire a new crew member because i feel like we are going to need one dang it Air arm. I have enough for it. Scrap recovery arm, which is aiding scrap. Oh, that's so frustrating. I think the best bet is just a heal up. I think that's our best option here. Oh, but I really would love the repair arm. Just to repair us up every time we collect scrap. That we're getting a bonus from because we have a scrap recovery arm. That is, that is slightly annoying. Okay, forward, and then we've got a couple of beacons, maybe three or four beacons we can check out before heading to the exit. We're out of the nebula. Cool, firebomb. I mean, I'll probably just sell that um, because it uses up missiles. All right, then, I guess. And stunner on the shields. They've only got level 1 shields, um, but they do have, I think, a flat cannon. We're going to knock out our... Do some damage to us if we don't... I, oh, we, I guess we can mess with the... I missed. Okay, never mind. Did only one damage, though. That's okay. There you go. They've got eight. We keep missing. It's not helping. And they're still able to fire the flat cannon. There we go, good. We're taking away their, well, one of the damage makers. That missed, nice. They've got seven now, I think. So we're doing like slow, slow damage here. They hit our weapons with one piece of flak, which is so annoying. It really is, does feel like the slowest run. Like, the slowest, like, level of upgrades that we've had in a while. I mean, they're probably going to jump away in a second. Yeah, we'll take the surrender, I guess. And they still launched a flat cannon, losers. Yeah, let's check what's in the store. We've only got 46 again, but we're going to sell that firebomb. Um, I have no need for it. Well, also, oh, no, I sold the drone already. Don't have anything I can get over there. Teal up again. Save our money. Cool. Yeah, I'm just gonna go to the exit. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna mess around. Looks like a really. It does feel like a really slow. Um, mantis controlled. You know, mantis controlled. Just a really slow like burn this run. I don't know why. Okay, a nice whole area of map with no nebulas at all. Everywhere we jump, we just need a bit of luck. We do need a little bit of luck. Where are the shields? There they are. They've got one level one shields, and if we can keep knocking those shields down and repeatedly fire on them, just keep ionizing those shields, maybe. 
Yeah, there we go. That's exactly what I'm on about. So the iron eye just keeps going. The dual lasers keeps on the weapons. We can't get hit. Provided stuff hits. Like, that. what is going on with the shooting? Do they keep missing everything? Elizabeth, you got to improve. I think that was another two misses. And because of that, because they're missing... Yeah, look at it. I mean, they're just missing so many shots. It, they can fire missiles on us. And just keep knocking out our engines. There we go. Finally, we got a hit. Really poor. I don't like... Gotta hit your shots. A miss. Another miss. Oh, my word. They must have, like, a cracking pilot. Is so, so slow. <laughs> there we go. Another good hit. Down to six hull integrity. We've only lost two. Um, our shields are holding pretty strong. Aries probably wants to get out of there. Get hit one more time. You might be done, Zoe. No surrender this time. No surrender this time. I'm not having it. I want the scrap. Oh, oh, yep. See, Ares didn't even run. He didn't even try and get away. He's just gone. Shields can't even really get repaired. I mean, the Iron Eyes... The Iron Cannon Stunner is the only thing doing it. Locking their shields out. Okay, one hull integrity left for the enemy ship. And there it is. It was su it's such a slow fight. Maybe I just need to save some scrap for a little bit. And just, well, I need to keep getting fuel, but just save some scrap and make some, like, major, major upgrades. Jones, lovely, look at that, we're lucky, we get a new crew member. Another, another distress signal, we need some fuel as well, oh my word. Ain't no way I'm losing a crew member I just got. Ain't no way. <laughs> Awesome, that was good, but still no fuel for that. Gonna be out of fuel next turn. Okay, they're coming to fight us, it looks like. One on one down there. Let's go and make it a two on one. Is their FTL charging? They started the fight. Get called back, I think. Yeah, I did get called back. Keep hitting the... Keep hitting them, I guess. If their FDO is charging, I mean, we probably want to knock it out. Knock the engine out, maybe. They're getting healed up because we were doing some good damage. There we go. Now the engines are down, so the FTO... There we go, delayed. Oh, you're back. Lana is back. Fighting the O2. I'm going to take the oxygen out of those rooms. Hey, it looks like... Oh, they didn't send another, but they're in... Yeah, they're... I mean, they're done. Nice. Back to positions. Only two hull integrity left. One, and... They're, yeah, okay, awesome. Good fight, but again, it's really slow. Like really slow because we're just firing two lasers that like we can't do that much damage. It's probably because when you start with the red um Ropa, lovely, welcome aboard. Awesome. Okay, you go back to the doors and we've actually gained some crew members. Awesome. Let's make another jump. We'll go here. Valeria, they'll get a little bit of health back, but it's not a lot. They mind the surrender their goods. Okay, straight onto the engines. The stunner can go on the shields. It's only a level 1 shield. I really wish we had another... We need more laser guns, basically. We need more laser guns. Repaired their engine, but it's just going to need repairing again. Keep knocking the shields with the iron stunner, I think think is the the right tactic 
and then just keep knocking on the engine. And that's delayed the FTL. They've got 708 hull integrity left. We're still sitting on 28, which is awesome. Like, somehow we, st we still haven't been hit since, like, a couple of fights. It's definitely because we only have one actual weapon that's doing hull damage. Whereas you start with the red tail. We start with four. And you can just hit, like, four kind of pronged attack. So we'll make a jump. We'll get away. We'll head towards the exit. Gray's with us, so now we're fighting. Again, so are they. That's an interesting one. Why can't I jump? Oh, because we're out of fuel. There we go. We've got no fuel left. Do we? Of course, we were, like, struggling on fuel this whole time. They're charging FTL. They just want to jump away, so... Try and knock their weapons instead. <clears throat> And try and make it so like they're less likely to hit me. They've got two weapons. In fact, let's put the dual lasers on the weapons as well. Like the shields are gonna stand up either way. Ion stunner on the on the shields. That missed, okay, but they're still charging, like they're just gonna jump away, and we've got an extra crew member in Shirai. So Shirai goes and works in the shields as well. I guess the shields are probably one of the most important um, to try and defend those, I guess. Oh, we did some damage. We actually did some whole damage. Um, but as long as their shields kind of stay... Oh, there we go. The FTL delayed. Um, I don't know how long their charge takes. It must take a while. Now it's on fire. Shields have been knocked to level 1, so we just got to try and fire off another barrage before that loads. We'll... Yep, yeah, there we go. Kinda. Not really. Okay, no, we are actually doing damage now, but they do... They do... Oh, there we go. They're going to jump away. They get away. Well, fair play. Um, no fuel. Gonna have to wait. And we get given some fuel. Lovely. Okay, we can escape and just get to the next sector. But still, no fuel. We've got so little fuel. We need scrap. Um. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. A nice uh, reactor upgrade. No, yeah, I'm going straight to the exit because I don't want to have to fight my way out again. Um, ignore that. Jump away. Next sector. Abandon sector. Again, look at that. We're so low on fuel. Straight away. Store. There's a store. Go straight to the store. We need some fuel. Okay, what do we got? Four missiles. If given time to prepare, the Swarm Launcher can replicate multi multiple warheads. Okay. Getting burst. Okay, I don't want any of those. Let's fix up and take all of the fuel they have. I'm going to get the hacking, because I don't always tend to do that. Get the power bar to work it. Um, it's down there, so it'll kind of be Banks's, be Banks's to worry about. But we can do that. We can do that. I don't, I don't usually get the hacking. Charlie. Charlie's an ace pilot. Better than fire. Hey, Fire, you're going to go and work the hacking with... No, actually... Yeah, no. Uh, let's keep you in the shields as well. Save those positions. So you're not the pilot anymore, Fire, but you are still the captain. Um, Okay.
I think shields is next. I think I think the next thing I want to do is get my shields all the way up. Um, so we'll do that. Regardless of if that's the best idea. Okay, it looks like all enemies now are going to have... I'm repair the O2, guys. I feel like I'm getting. Yeah, so that's actually wasting drone parts because I'm not able to fire. Go away! You're setting on fire to my random areas. Are we just gonna jump away? I'm gonna jump away from that one because uh, the drone, the hacking was doing nothing, and it was just gonna be a bit of a slog, I think. I want that fire to go out. There we go. And then jump away. There we go. Put a bit of distance between us and the chasing pack. Same situation again. However, this time they don't have... They don't have... There we go. Okay, oh, another fire. Cool. Cheers. Losers. Setting fire to my shit. Fire going to go out. There we go. Oh, they keep hitting us with the missiles. Like, we need... I think maybe we do need the defense drones to try and fire down block missiles. Because that seems to be, like, part of the... The biggest thing that kind of stops us. And we're taking damage, so I'm just going to jump away again. Oh... Nice, so we've got a system repair drone, which is cool, but we just we still don't have the drone control system and we're out of fuel again. We're gonna have to wait. Get out of town, would you? Level three, getting hit by everything. It's just we need like it's been such a slow burn. Like I've been able to like getting no scrap, like trying to upgrade anything. Oh, they're locked on. I can't jump away because I've got no fuel. So fix the O2. That hurt. So did that. Go fix that on your onesie. The engines as well. Like, and we can't go anywhere. Like, we, we're absolutely sitting ducks right now. Mess their shields up. That's it. That's it. Okay, fine. I don't know, we didn't have the firepower, we didn't have anything, the shields, the anything. Can't jump away, no fuel, like everything kind of been a bit meh. There we go. I think I've got to go back to the red tail. It feels like such a such a cop out, but I think I do. Ships defeated only 10. Um 45 beacons explored. Not very many. Scrap collected, only 346. Like that is really nothing. Through higher 10, yeah. I mean, that's kind of crazy. Well. Well, okay, it was our first attempt with this Swallow ship, so. Redtail does seem to be. Redtail or the Kestrel are my best scores. If I look at, like, top scores, it's the Kestrel that leads the way. Redtail's in there with one as well. But we've still never beaten the bad boy. So we're going to have to try and do that next time. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I do hope you've enjoyed today's episode of FTL. FTL is such a cool game. It's not really going anywhere. Like, it's going to stay on the channel for a little bit. Um, It's so fun. Uh, I mean, I'm a little bit kind of mellow today. I'm a little bit kind of, like, tired. Like, I can feel my eyes a little bit. But it's still, it's still such a fun game. Just we didn't have the best time of it with that particular ship. Never mind. We'll try again. Thank you for watching. Catch you next time.